Can women experience orgasms while sleeping? What is the relationship between diet and sexual desire in women? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Yes, women can experience orgasms during sleep, a phenomenon known as nocturnal orgasm or erotic dreams. This is entirely normal and should not cause concern. Diet can influence women's sexual desire. A balanced and nutritious diet can promote sexual health by maintaining a healthy body weight and ensuring adequate blood flow. Some foods, such as certain natural aphrodisiacs, can stimulate sexual desire. Kama Sutra-inspired tattoos. Some people choose tattoos based on the Kama Sutra as a way to express their connection to sensuality and eroticism, using symbols and figures from the ancient text. Latex and leather clothing fetishism. Latex and leather clothing fetishism involves sexual attraction towards tight and shiny garments, such as latex suits or leather jackets. These garments may symbolize power, dominance, or simply be aesthetically appealing to those with this fetish. In indigenous communities in Latin America, sex education may be integrated into initiation ceremonies and traditional rituals, transmitting knowledge about sexuality in a culturally relevant and respectful manner. Legislation and censorship. Pornography is subject to laws and regulations in many countries, ranging from total censorship to regulation of production and distribution to ensure compliance with legal and ethical standards. Masturbation and body exploration. Masturbation can be a powerful way to explore and understand female anatomy, allowing women to discover what types of stimulation are most pleasurable for them. Masturbation and partner communication. Openly discussing masturbation with a partner can foster greater understanding, trust, and emotional connection in the relationship. Masturbation as a healthy practice. Masturbation is a normal and healthy sexual activity that can provide pleasure, relieve stress, and help people learn about their own bodies and sexual desires. Masturbation. During pregnancy, Many women continue to masturbate during pregnancy as it can help alleviate sexual tension and maintain intimacy with their partners. In some indigenous cultures in Latin America, such as the Maya in Guatemala, there are ancestral traditions that include teaching about sexuality as an integral part of life and individual worldview. In Mexico, online and social media-based sexual education campaigns targeting teenagers have been created using language and visual content adapted to their youth culture to address sexuality topics in an accessible and relevant way. Muscle training. Some men may benefit from training the pelvic floor muscles, such as Kegel exercises, which can strengthen control over ejaculation by improving bladder retention capacity. Myths about virginity. Virginity is a socially constructed concept and can have different meanings for different people and cultures. There is no one way to define the loss of virginity, and it does not have to be exclusively associated with vaginal penetration. In the Netherlands, sex education focuses on prevention and contraception and is considered one of the most comprehensive programs in the world. Despite openness on this topic, the Netherlands has one of the lowest teenage pregnancy rates in Europe. Object trapping fetishism. Some people experience sexual arousal from being trapped in objects such as tight clothing, furniture, or even confined spaces. Orgasm control toys. Some sex toys are designed to help individuals control their arousal and delay orgasm, such as penis rings with adjustable vibration or resistance training devices. Pelvic floor training toys. Kegel exercises are beneficial for strengthening the pelvic floor. Additionally, there are sex toys specifically designed for pelvic floor training, which can help improve sexual health and prevent incontinence. Pharmacological treatment. In severe cases, 
doctors may prescribe medications such as antidepressants or local anesthetics to help control premature ejaculation. However, these should be used under medical supervision due to possible side effects. Piercing fetishism. Similar to tattoo fetishism, some individuals experience sexual arousal towards piercings in certain parts of the body, finding piercings erotically appealing. Pornography and sexual fantasies. Pornography can serve as a source of inspiration for sexual fantasies, allowing people to explore and experiment with scenarios and practices that may otherwise be inaccessible or unsafe. Positions that promote communication. To strengthen emotional connection, some women prefer positions that facilitate verbal and nonverbal communication with their partner, such as missionary with hugs and caresses. Pregnancy fetishism. Some people find sexual arousal in the physical and hormonal changes associated with pregnancy. This can manifest as increased sexual interest in pregnant women. Prevention of mother-to-child transmission. With proper treatment during pregnancy and childbirth, the transmission of certain STDs from mother to baby can be prevented or significantly reduced. Psychological origins. Fetishes can have different psychological origins, from early childhood experiences to subconscious associations developed over time. Some studies suggest that fetishes may arise as coping mechanisms to deal with anxiety or stress. Recognition of pornography as entertainment. Despite controversies and debates about its impact, pornography remains widely recognized as a form of adult entertainment and an expression of human sexuality, rediscovery in the digital age. With the advent of the internet, the Kama Sutra has experienced a resurgence online with numerous websites, blogs, and resources dedicated to exploring and sharing its teachings in a modern context. Relationship. Between sex and sleep, sex can have benefits for sleep onset as the release of endorphins and relaxation experienced during orgasm can help induce a state of drowsiness. Relaxation. Techniques. Practicing relaxation techniques, such as deep breathing, meditation, or yoga, can help reduce anxiety and improve sexual response in individuals with stress-related anorgasmia. Rising popularity. Over time, sex toys have gained increasing acceptance and popularity in modern society, becoming more common and accessible in both physical stores and online. Role of pheromones. Pheromones, chemicals released by the body, are believed to influence sexual attraction and reproductive behavior in humans, although their exact impact is still a subject of scientific debate. Screening tests. Regular STD screening tests are important, especially for sexually active individuals or those with multiple sexual partners, as many STDs can be present without obvious symptoms. Self-help. Techniques. In addition to medical treatments, there are self-help techniques that can help men manage erectile dysfunction, such as masturbation to maintain erectile function and the use of penis rings to maintain erection. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.